here we go. What happens to drinking out of the bottle? Oh, well, what can I say? I'm a classy bird. Uh, not too classy, I hope. There's no rush. You know, let's have a few more drinks. Are you trying to mess with my head or something? No. What do you mean? Why did you invite me up here? I mean, why bother getting back with me? Because I missed you. Didn't feel like it. You don't trust me, do you? You still think I had something to do with what happened to Seb? No, I don't. I think you had something to do with the Seb thing. OK, I do trust you. Then why are you acting so weird? Yeah, we're back together, but we haven't slept together, have we? You used to be all over me like a rash. So I'm going to ask you again. Why did you really invite me up here? Look, everything that you said was true. OK, I, I am acting a bit weird. Look, I do want to sleep with you, OK? But at the same time, it just feels wrong. You know, us being happy and enjoying ourselves when someone's dead. Do you know what I mean? Oh, where are you going? I'll just give me a call when it does feel right. Oh, don't be like that. No, you're messing me around. Look, I'm just upset about Seb. But I'm not. Look, I didn't say that. OK, don't go. Please. <sighs> I'm as gutted about Seb as you are. All right, it's a tragedy. But it's not our fault. We shouldn't feel guilty for enjoying ourselves. If anything, a moment like this should make you realise that you've just got to... grab every moment. You're right. Hey, I'm sorry. Hey, stay. Please. When you say stay... I mean, stay the night. Together. Can we at least finish these first? 